What a big weekend in Boston, Massachusetts. Monday morning, they'll run the 127th Boston Marathon. Then the record-setting Bruins will host the Panthers Monday night. And of course, this afternoon, it's the two-seed Celtics welcoming in the Atlanta Hawks as we welcome you to the NBA playoffs presented by Google Pixel. It is the first round. And the first round is presented by Starry. Take a look at our Eastern Conference playoff bracket. Philadelphia has taken a 1-0 lead on Brooklyn. Getting ready for game one between the Celtics and the Hawks here at TD Garden. As we look for the visiting Hawks, the backcourt of Trey Young, DeJounte Murray in his first season with Atlanta, DeAndre Hunter, John Collins, Clint Capella round out the front court for the Boston Celtics. They will continue to send Robert Williams off the bench now that he is back from his hamstring injury. This unit with Derek White starting has been fantastic this season. One of the best five-man units in the NBA. And a timeout taken by Atlanta. 7.05 to go in the first quarter of game one. The Celtics an early 12-8 lead. I'm out on the floor. And if you are a Boston Celtic fan, this is what you like to see. Jason Tatum taking the matchup. DeJounte Murray right now. Boston Celtics up eight. Today's moment to celebrate is brought to you by Casamigos Tequila. What a season for Jason Tatum and Jalen Brown. A historic one for the duo. 25 points in the same game, 33 times. Most in Shaq and Kobe. In the 2000-2001 season, second Celtics duo to average 25 plus apiece. The old is pretty good too. And the fourth highest scoring duo in a season since the 76-77 season. Only Shaq and Kobe who did it twice. Celtics shoot at 50%. Jason Tatum pours in 13 points and it's Boston by 10 after one at TD Garden. Jalen Brown, he is dancing. Right now, the Boston Celtics are on a 10-1 run, and there is three of Brown's nine. NBA First Round on ESPN, presented by Starry, is brought to you by Google Pixel, the official fan phone of the NBA. And when we talk about who's having an important impact on this game, Robert Williams, he only played in 35 of the 82 games. But right now, he is four for four. He's got three rebounds, two assists, one steal, and one block, and multiple finishes, ladies and gentlemen. The Time Lord with an outstanding... NBA first round playoff coverage continues tonight. Next on ESPN at 6 Eastern, it's the Knicks and the Cavs. Then at 8.30... On ABC, the Warriors are in Sacramento taking on the Kings. I, 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 everybody keeps talking about it, but it's so true. I, I just cannot wait to see that atmosphere in Sacramento tonight on ABC. We go in this first half, and the Celtics dumping Atlanta 59 to 32. Welcome back to the NBA Playoffs presented by Google Pixel. We're here in Boston for the first round presented by Starry. Trey Young having a rough first half against this Boston defense. Yeah, they just have so many bodies to throw at him. He's got big guards like Derek White here, the reigning defensive player of the year, Marcus Smart. Here he's in front of Brogdon. And not only does he have a big guard in front of him, but he's got big wings on the defensive end that he's got to deal with. Jason Tatum, Jalen Brown. So for him, his vision, I think, will improve over the course of the series. But right now, he's having a little bit of trouble figuring it out with his team shooting one for 16 from three. And he's the one. Well, Mark is smart in the Celtics. Shot it at 60%. Held it, landed at 33%. And they have a 74-44 lead at the half. Our studio crew coming up next. Boy, this 30-point lead. Welcome back to the NBA playoffs presented by Google Pixel. We're in Boston for the first round presented by Starry. Taking a look at... 
today's playoff tracker. It's brought to you by Ruffles. Coming up next on ESPN, Knicks and the Cavs. Everyone looking forward to that series. And then tonight on ABC, you'll have the Kings and the Warriors. Richard, I know you, you've mentioned this Knicks-Cavs series to me at least four or five times since we've come to TD Garden today. This is a series you're really looking forward to. No, I, I am looking forward to it. Look, you got Evan Mobley, Defensive Player of the Year opportunity. J.B. Bickerstaff, you know, has a chance to be Coach of the Year, even though it's going to go to Mike Brown in Sacramento. You know, they've just done a great job there, but ultimately... Playoff coverage continues from Memphis tomorrow on ABC 3 Eastern. LeBron and the Lakers face John Morant and the Grizzlies. Coverage begins with NBA Countdown at 2.30. That's one of those put your money where your mouth is games because everyone in the world is picking Atlanta. Brown up to 22 and the Celtics remain in firm control. The NBA and first round playoff coverage continues tonight on ESPN Next. Donovan Mitchell and the Cavs getting ready to host the Knicks. The Knicks thought they would have Mitchell in the offseason and said Cleveland swooped in, and wow, if they loved having him. And then 8.30 Eastern on ABC, the Warriors in Sacramento to take on the Kings. Easy commute for both teams in that series, and Sacramento ready to host a playoff game for the first time since. Quarter on a 23-10 run, fourth quarter of game one. Coming up next, Celtics leading by 19. In this fourth quarter. I'll tell you what, 13 points with a potential to bring it down to 12 with nine to go here in the fourth. Check out the N1. Right now, the, the Atlanta Hawks making a little bit of run. NBA First Round on ESPN is presented by Starry, a crisp burst of lemon lime flavor. And in part by Google Pixel, the official fan phone. Atlanta on an extended 31-12 run over the last nine minutes. Yeah, but they're starting to get going right there in transition, getting a steal. And Johnson with the open three. And Bob Donovan, we talked about him. This man had zeros across the board at halftime here in the third quarter. Starting to get his go team going, gets the steal, and the and one. Up by DeJounte Murray, and Joe Mazzula will take a timeout. 14-point game, still 3.47 to go. Big performance from Jalen Brown. Two games down today, and two more to go, including Knicks and Cavs up next on ESPN. You see the Sixers and Celtics have each taken 1-0 leads in their series. Once again, our final score, the Celtics 112 and the Hawks 99. Knicks and Cavs game one coming up next for our producer, Paul Irvin, our director, Adam Bryant. Richard Jefferson, Roz Gold on Woody, and our entire crew. I'm Ryan Rucco. Good night from Boston. We'll join our studio team after the break.